Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Great Night Pre-Show Green Room Extravaganza. My name is Bryce Castillo. I'm your pre-show green room navigator. We're going to take you into the green room here in just a minute. Oh, that's Corey. Thank you so much, Corey. Oh, oh there he is. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, before we go into the green room, coming up, we're going to have a great show for you today. Justin's back. Brian's here. We've got me. We've got Brett. Corey's running the camera today. We've got, uh, we've got one, one Joe Mo. We've got Joe Mo from the, the Possum Possum. Oh, of course, he is, uh, uh, back. Gonna, gonna give us some more great music. We love it. We love, we love Joe Mo. So, that's that. Uh, uh, can we get that as a bitly, please? Uh, and and we will have a we will have the link to. to we'll we'll talk about the mic stuff a little later. So don't worry about it. We're we're gonna talk with Mike. In fact, ooh, see, ooh, secretly, secretly, we will talk with Mike. So that'll be cool. Um, and then we got a game. We got a fantastic new game. It's a game from yours truly called the Hollywood. Hollywood? Nope, that's not Hollywood. Walk of Fame or Shame. So that'll be fun. Alrighty. Well, let's uh, let's see. Let's do this. All right. Let's take it over to the green room. Uh, fellas, can you hear me? Uh, we can uh, see you. Bryce. We can see you, but we cannot hear you. You can't hear me. Oh, interesting. Oh, now. Oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. All right. Have a have a good green room. Oh uh, man. Uh so how do we how do we explain what we've been up to? <laughs> uh wow. well, you know, look, I was I was really busy hanging out on a movie set and all my friends are famous yeah. and I wrote Doctor Strange. Yeah. Oh no wait. Oh that was Yeah. No, that was a uh, That was the I mean we fucked. We, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh uh man, it's good to be back. God it's damn. Very, very uh back. yeah. Uh so 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 it took you leaving uh national borders in order to to break the show. Uh well, yeah, the national borders of Austin. <laughs> I was in Dallas last time. Oh. Uh but uh well uh, same thing yeah in my book have any of the cities because texas has really got a hard on for the for the 15 minutes that they seceded from the union like has any of any like cities like did their mini version of like seceding from the closest has been texas? austin is that it yeah uh, vider oh that's right what happened to vider <laughs> Wait, no, well, like, i barely I know, know it. It. <laughs> they, they, they have some quaint ideas about race there, uh yeah and, no uh, they 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 God damn it. and magic <laughs> And uh, magic? Well, I mean, they have a grand wizard, I assume. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's a magic city right next door. They love Harry Potter. Yeah. And they have this weird thing about the sun going down. And, uh, yeah, weird. Uh, uh, so uh, this is the part, and we talked about this right before we went live. It was like we were yeah. all loose and, and vibing, and then it's like uh, we're uh, spotlight's going to come on us. We're all going to clam right up, and sure enough, uh, I made what, you were you're, you didn't like the Grand Wizard joke. That was a good joke. <laughs> that was a good that was joke. pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we fucked. <laughs> uh, uh, man, jeez, uh, this show. <laughs> what the fuck's going on? Uh, 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 I was in Mexico. I saw Lucha Libre. Y'all ever seen Lucha Libre wrestling live? Heard, no, no, but I'd love to. I heard it. I I heard. Did you hear? Did you heard it? I heard was, it was did, great. Was somebody unmasked? During the show? No, the final match was a hair versus mask match, though. What Sorry? does that mean? That means that the, the either... That means he wore the mask, it. but over his crotch. Yeah. <laughs> Who will win? Yeah. Yeah. God, that actually would be a funny <laughs> thing. Like, like, like a hair versus mask match, but the guy's bald, and he has to shave his balls <laughs> if he loses. Win the Merkin. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> uh... So, yeah, if uh, uh, one guy had a beautiful flowing locks, the other had a famous mask. And oh. uh, uh, so whoever lost either had to shave their head or oh. unmask. And uh, Psycho Clown beat Ray Escorpion. No way. And, and Ray Escorpion had to shave his head. 
Well, okay. Now, now yeah. here, here's the question. Also, because by the way, the Clippers didn't work, and it was a very awkward 30 minutes in the ring as oh. they were looking for other Clippers. Oh. It sounds like every Magic convention I've been to. <laughs> <laughs> so with a mask, you could steal their mask and then put it on your face or run around and flap your arms and like, look at me, I'm this other guy. Sure. Yeah. Like, do you take their severed hair and you go like, ooh, oh, look at me. No, you go look at the hair on my balls. That's exactly. what you do. Oh, no, you rub it. Traditionally, and this is a traditional Mexican thing, is they take uh, rubber cement and they lightly coat their balls <laughs> and then place their there enemies hair uh, on onto their balls. Yeah. They, they bust tradition. They have they have local <laughs> dignitaries like place the first strand and I, you know. I have a question about uh, the masking. Yeah. So this is is this a person that no, otherwise we don't know their identity up to that point, and it, now that's what it's about. From, so from, it, from, yeah, 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 yeah. But before you tell me the real thing, go ahead. My outsider understanding is that culturally, like, uh, th this person will wear the mask like to go to the Seven Eleven. Yes. Mm. Like, like they will t do their day IT job uh, with In their mask on, <laughs> and everybody knows. Uh, like, just and it, like Does that make, that makes no sense, uh, right? Uh, Be all right? Because it, you're like. Bruce Wayne's out and about. Sure. So right. If you're wearing the mask, the whole point is you can be out. Otherwise, if you just wear the mask all the time, everybody's like, oh, you, that guy. So you you, they know who you are. You're the uh, guy that always Two wears words, it. my friend. Red Skull. All right? That dude wore the mask <laughs> on the job. All right? Yeah. So, yeah, you are effectively a different person. Uh, number one, you can never go wrong Googling wrestlers in suits. It's always a funny thing. They're very large people. The suits fit very awkwardly. It's, it's just a good time to look at. Yeah. Even better, luchadors in suits because it's all of that awkward fitting, but also they're wearing masks at things like funerals and dinners and like really? uh, Mexican presidents wearing in ceremonies. Like, this is this really? is like a for real, for real. I thing. mean, and, and there's precedent of this in these United States. Uh, Richard Nixon wore that fake ass nose <laughs> the yes. entire presidency. The entire he never. Yeah, uh, really, yeah, yeah. even as, as he got impeached. Or, yeah. perfect that's why. That's I right. am not El <laughs> Santo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> But he lo it, he only wore it because he lost a hair versus fake nose mask. <laughs> That's right. And so he had to apply it for the rest of his They're life. Like you have to do the peace sign. <laughs> That's what was going on in that the Watergate victory. building. That was mostly the Watergate thing. Yeah. That's yeah. what it's Most about. Most of Watergate was about that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so so you're saying these guys live their life day to day just in a mask? If they want to be famous, really? then they walk around with the mask and they are like intensely yeah. famous. Are like, there any luchador lawyers? <laughs> I, is it, is it, is I is it, like, like, like I, 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 siempre justice, uh, 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 I would not be, would not be shocked. Porque no? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is an opportunity. Mojitos, <laughs> porque? Pointing at the camera, porque. he's just like, uh, going, en el coche, no? Yeah, <laughs> si. Uh, 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 Abigail, uh, wait. You know more Spanish than I do. I don't know any Spanish. This is way more Spanish than I learned growing up. This is good. Wait, what is what is Spanish for lawyer? Ooh. Aba esque. Aba esque. Yes. Aba esque. So you're only 17. So good base No. Where are we Oh, yeah, I know. You got it. There we go. Freaking Abogada. All right, all right, all right. I don't know how you knew that. That's incredible. Yeah, well, I, uh... <laughs> 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 the red. kind of mask. <laughs> wow. Uh, so, okay. yeah, the man who won, who, who uh, uh, kept his mask, was Psycho Clown. Psycho Clown, the number one luchador in uh, a triple A, or triple A, as they say here in the States. Yeah. Is his yeah. name Psycho Clown in English? Yeah. It's not... No, his, 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 his song, it, it, his, his song it, it, is literally just a loop of a guy going, Psycho Loco, Psycho <laughs> Clown, Psycho Loco, Psycho Clown. Seems like the truly psycho thing to do would be to like win the match and then, as if you're confused, shave off your own hair. <laughs> <laughs> was, but keep your you mask. Know, <laughs> all right, all right here's, here's, here's actually. His name. We thought it was just like, <laughs> And then his lawyer shows up. <laughs> here's, and he, Here's, here's, all right, there's a moment at the very beginning because it was actually a very touching thing because uh, Psycho Clown is a second generation wrestler. Hmm. His father was a wrestler, very famous. And so they have this very tricky dicky clown. Just wait for it. Oh, there's, oh. There's oh. A payoff. <laughs> uh, 
uh, uh, uh, so this is very touching thing. They play this whole like uh, 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 tribute to all these old dead wrestlers, and then they add his father there. He comes out with like his family, and he's like holding a picture of his father, and his father's name was Super Porky. <laughs> Super they, Porky. Super Porky. And they play this like they play this like clip of him doing it, and it's it's like. You know, uh, the closest thing that I think that, that uh, Americans would get is like like Sabado Gigante level comedy okay. of just like a fat guy running around and falling down and jumping out of a wrestling ring. But it's this very touching thing and the whole arena is fucking into it and everything. So it was like it was a very like like very weird mix. If you watched it just totally without any context and yeah. not being there, you'd be like, this is like. Uh, Mr. Show level, like absurd, but uh, uh, there everyone's like, oh, yeah, <laughs> oh, <laughs> super, porky. super, super porky. I wish I knew more uh, Dick Nixon quotes. Yeah, uh, <laughs> 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 sorry. Uh, <laughs> it makes wait, me wait, want wait, yo no soy a crook. Soy el crook. Yo, yo no es bandito. He would have beat the rap with that shit. <laughs> like, no. Well, he's got a solid argument there. Yeah. <laughs> I want to know if there's like a Blue Man Group wrestler version. There's, you know how there's like, there's no. I think the Blue Man Group is. Oh just wait, like like like, like franchising out your. Yeah. your okay, Can so you in, that another like like imagine if the Avengers were luchadors. Okay. Sure. You would have like five five yes. different franchises of the Avengers running around. Right. So they they do keep gimmicks around. So if you ever see a luchador that is somebody junior, that is not their actual son or daughter. Ah. That is somebody who has taken that gimmick and now. Like, Bought they the are costume or something, or? basically. Yeah. yeah. It, now, if it is El Hijo de that name, that is that's their, their real son. son. Interesting. But they will also just take the gimmick, and the gimmick will live on uh, uh, forever. Yeah. Uh, uh, but no, there is a, a line of Mexican wrestlers called the Vianos, and the Vianos just multiply. Like throughout the '90s, there was like seven Vianos, but they all called themselves like Viano One, Viano Two, <laughs> Viano Three, Viano wow. Four. And so during one of the battle royals, and one of the things that I saw, there was a Viano Four Junior. So it wasn't even the son of Viano Four. It was somebody who's like, well, of all the Vianos, <laughs> number four, like, yeah, to be Viano Four. Do you know what's really funny? I did a a. Uh, anime uh -huh. uh, called Excel Saga, and in it there were luchador bad guys. That, but instead of being bad guy one, bad guy two, it was this guy, that guy, the other guy. Oh, really? Another guy, yet another guy, and it was like this, and they all looked the same. This yeah. is this guy, this is that guy. That's great. The other yeah. guy. <laughs> See, now I want to, now I want to go and like uh, take, uh, I, I don't know, a Spanish dub of of, of like a teen movie. I want to, I want to call myself Jomo Junior. And 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 cut up the movie and become a YouTube hit and say uh, es mi quinceañera. <laughs> I am not Jomo. <laughs> just rip done. off your song, just straight <laughs> yeah, up. It could be done, yeah. Yeah, I think that'd be. It's a limited market. <laughs> 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 when I was in I America, the, uh, <laughs> Jumbo's response to that is like, uh, "You should really aim higher." Yeah, like, you know, like, I don't know, man. Like, I think you should expand your horizons. Like, yeah, definitely. Now I want to go to one of these uh, luchador fights. Uh, it was matches? it was great. It was great. We went to two of them. Uh, one is CMLL, which is also in Mexico City. They they are the oldest wrestling company in the world. They've been around for eighty five years. They always run on Friday nights in the same place. And uh, there was a 60-year-old Blue Panther who looked every day of 60-plus who dove off a stage for a roughly 300 people in the audience wow. in, in Arena Mexico. So it was pretty great. How, how I, I know you are fascinated with the lore, the background, the execution, everything about the wrestling. Uh, is, is, is Ashley as into it as you are, or is this an indulgence for you? No, I think she, she likes it enough that she can ride Chuck, and especially when we're doing, like, 
trips. Like, you know, she if, if if I were like going to a random thing, she might not do it. Although uh, now that I think about it, there hasn't really been a wrestling thing that she said no to recently. So wait, uh, so this is a habit. This is something you've done before. Oh yeah, no, I'm. This I'm is like, a, you're no, an enthusiast. I, I, I went. I went out to Japan. I saw it's Japanese ritual wrestling. de la uh, habitual. Oh, so this yeah. is wrestling. So you're a wrestling enthusiast. You're like a multicultural wrestling enthusiast. I'm a nerd. I mean, like yeah. wrestling, wrestling okay, nerds. Okay. Like you know, it, it's it's like you know, if you're like a a country music fan, yeah. you want to go see certain places that right. like, have been famous like throughout history so so like grand Ole opry grand Ole opry yeah, or yeah. you know those like venues out in california like for, yeah. for like that those kind of like a uh, uh, sound so it's like uh that is like what it is for wrestling it's like there are a few hotbeds it's like really hot in america the uk mexico and japan what's a japanese wrestling match other than oh, sumo wrestling oh it's not sumo wrestling oh, oh no 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 no, no. Yeah. It, it's yeah. basically like the same pro wrestling like so Really? American pro wrestlers will get famous in Japan. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, and then they'll come. In fact, Japanese wrestlers will come back here and get okay. famous here. The only the weird thing about Japanese crowds is that they're very respectful. Hierarchy is like a very big thing. So like in America, if a match is crazy, if the first match is like insane, the crowd will scream as loud as they want to because they're like, "This is the craziest thing I've ever seen." I don't care if it's the first match. In Japan, they know that it is a disrespect for the people at. In for the, the for the top card, yeah. If you are getting too excited, <laughs> so in the end they'll cheer, but at the very beginning, it doesn't matter what you're doing, they might go like, oh, oh, oh. Yeah. oh. but they will not scream, chant, cheer. Like UK, they'll they'll sing their songs. It's like a soccer yeah. culture here. We'll we'll cheer. Mexico is pretty loud, but uh, yeah, Japan is like. But then when it gets to the end, nuts. It's they're like screaming the entire time. It's, yeah. it was it was a, 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 an awesome an awesome vibe. So, um, I'm sorry to keep asking questions about this, but oh, I'm just so yeah, sure. no, because yeah. I mean, all you're doing, what, you, what, you, what are you going to keep the so, conversation afloat? Yeah, <laughs> why don't we have? Why haven't we had an awkward pause yet? <laughs> yeah, this is there we go. This <laughs> is I have a mild. <laughs> That's my new character, the awkward pause. <laughs> awkward pause. <laughs> um, could it be a pregnant pause too? Could that be like mm. his wife? I'm going to get her pregnant. <laughs> okay, so are these guys famous because <laughs> they are basically? How do you become a famous, successful wrestler? Do you gotta you have to come up with a gimmick that's crazy? Yes, you've got to be like flamboyant. You are you are an independent creative. contractor. Okay, so like it, it's it's a lot like music where okay. like you uh, uh, except in, imagine that you really didn't have the option to do solo shows. Okay, you could only do showcase shows. Yeah. And Only that's the, yeah ag uh, against another band. And uh, yeah, you also Battle had to. Battle of the band. You also had to. Uh, you were like going to be like reflecting against this other. This and other I have person. to wear a uniform. Just, a mask uh, hold it real quick. Let's put a, put a pin in this conversation. I was trying to we think of. I was trying to think of a metaphor, <laughs> and the closest thing I could think of is like imagine if you're in a small town and the only place to sing was at church, yeah. <laughs> and there was only one church and there was only one choir, and you had to figure out a way to stand out. <laughs> <laughs> and so you came up with a gimmick <laughs> because the only place you were ever going to be able to sing in public was in choir, choir yeah. at church. Yeah. So it's like you might, you might, you might, you know, put on goth makeup yeah. <laughs> and then, and then like uh, in the middle of a Hosanna go. <laughs> yeah. Maybe grab, grab the titty of the girl next yeah. to you or that something. Was, that's oh, the bad be. boy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The bad oh, boy, the church bad singer. Boy church. Next thing you know, they're selling tickets to the Sunday morning service. Exactly. Like line out the door. There's a cage at the front. There are people yeah. scalping tickets. Could you imagine, yeah, like, yeah. like four, 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 Jesus, four, four Sundays in a row, somebody's inappropriately touching another church <laughs> choir member, and finally somebody's like, oh, I'm sorry, i got to say it, walks up, grabs a mic from the preacher, is like, I've stood by for too long. I challenge you to a sing off. Off and it's and yeah, it, you know I, it's. I, I can see this playing out. <laughs> oh, dude, yeah, it makes total sense. The yeah, whole town. That was a great. That would be the greatest yeah. church ever. <laughs> That wasn't really a metaphor. It was just a pitch. <laughs> yeah. That's what I think. I'm Very super. Detailed. I'm super into it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what, would, what would the bad boy choir singer be named? Uh, uh, Christian sol soldier. Christian soldier. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> hey, my name's Christian. <laughs> my name is Chris. Christian. Short. For yeah. what? For what? Christian Soldier. 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 <laughs> you ever hear that song? Soldier. Onward, Christian Soldier. Soldiers. They direction. wrote it about me. It's not a song. It's telling me what to do. <laughs> yeah. Go onward. Uh, that is. That's two, three. <laughs> Dude, that's not a bad wrestling name. Christian <laughs> Soldier. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's pretty good. <laughs> Dude, yeah. like, He's like, hey, what am I doing, preacher? What am I doing? I'm marching ass to war. That's right. That's right. No? No. I think like that he also grabs titties. <laughs> yeah. He grabs the titties. Like, anyway, yeah, move did. over, Gertrude. Obviously, Starts playing the pipe organ. Obviously religious. This is obviously a church thing. Yeah. Like a titty. Now, grabbing wait a minute. Titties. That's the doors it's he's playing. D I D D Y, by the way, grabbing a titty. <laughs> titty. That's how God said it. Yeah. yeah. Hey, what are you uh, doing? Just uh, grabbing a titty. Uh, that, 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 that's actually how it's spelled in the original Aramaic. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, re real quick. Ranking from most innocuous to least innocuous uh, names for breasts. Uh, titty, T I D D Y, yeah. is, is playful. Right. Well, yes. oh, 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 you're, when you're you say it that way, that sounds weird. We're, okay, yeah. Here we go. Titi. Uh, 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 <laughs> you're saying you 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 voice the T. Titi. Titi. I don't know anyone who does that. Titi. Yeah, that would be okay. Offensive. What about okay? Booby. Boobies. Booby versus Titi. Or, we, do or we, we we should do like a Final Four tournament. Of what, the, about, also what, are we, what are we judging for? I, I, There's also I, 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 I just want to yeah. scale. Ah, see, tit tit seems dismissive, right? Yeah. Yeah. Like, that's what oh, yeah, my my, do my dog's that's got not, tits. Yeah, that, so what are we? Look at them we, bitch titties. What are we? <laughs> that's, that's what I say about my dog. There's, there's <laughs> thing, I was saying that the other day. I was like, I was like, look at that. That's on his Wikipedia. When I got here, that's what he said. Brian was out there. He I said, mean, look at my dog's look at that bitch's titties. Look at those bitches' titties. There's, there's the, the what, what is it? I said, the, wow, uh, man. I just got here. <laughs> no, I think about it. That was a weird way to introduce you to the place. Yeah. <laughs> Especially because I gestured that there but was dude, no dog there. But dude, no. but dude, that bitch did have some tits. <laughs> bitch, yeah. I mean, I mean, look, I'm. Of course. I'm like, look, look at the titties on that bitch. Oh, damn. That's what they said at the American Kennel Club. <laughs> so, so. Is is that where's the tournament end up? Then? Yeah, is that where yeah, it ends we're up? just saying the words. We, we have eyes. Permission. There's eyes because you know. Uh, uh, titties so are the eyes of the chest. Twitter, 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 <laughs> that's Twitter, right. That's our eyes are the titties of the, of the face. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 No, I was. I was with you. I was with you. Um, <clears throat> all right. So wait. So what are we judging these for? Uh, 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 most uh, innocuous <laughs> or most 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 innocuous, but also like what about just trying this on. Look at them big old jingle jangles. <laughs> no. It's so now you're inventing them. Yeah. We've gone from judging them to inventing. So uh, how I would, I would like to one. imagine like yeah. this is a country folk doctor who's just like, listen, baby, you got some big old jingle jangles. Uh, listen, I found a lump, a very this... serious lump on your jingle yeah, exactly. jangles. I would just like, all right, so he's a country doctor. He refers to his female patients as baby. Baby. And he says jingle jangles. <laughs> also I love the idea like, that you have to give the diagnosis. <laughs> hey, listen, baby. No, I found a very suspicious lump on those jingle jangles of yours. Yeah. Big We're going to need a buy up. My, my, uh, He's also wearing a luchador mask. That's to put you in a bad mammogrammer. Bad mammogram. My wife has told me, EK has told me this. She goes, if a doctor cannot call the thing that's on me by its proper name, <laughs> It's time to go, is what she said. She's like, right, it's, yeah. It's it makes time. sense. It's so like, only jingle jangles. Jingle, <laughs> so jingle jangles. So only jingle jangles. You know, we, we need to check down there. No, yeah. got to right. go. Yeah. Got to. Yeah. I'm out. I'm out. So I should have left when my uh, insurance doctor said, uh, all right, let's check out them boys. Yeah. Hey, them the, that them dick, Duke man. boys. Them boys. Yeah. I mean, I mean, hey, Bo hey, and hey, Luke. Hey, baby, let me get a little, get a, get a little look at that dick. Yeah. Can I see that dick? Can I see that dick? Yeah. Can I see that dick? Can I see You're that? doctor. Hey, man. Pop hey, up. baby. Let hey, me pop hey, baby. that dick. Let's see. Come on. Pop that dick out. Huh? Pop that dick out. Let's take a look. Oh, we got a gander in that dick. <laughs> <laughs> puts on fucking well. Wait, 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 pulls up, pulls up opera fucking specs. Like, yeah. Okay. How, ma how many references to Dukes of Hazard does your doctor make before you leave? 
<laughs> he's all like, all right, right, if you don't mind spreading them Desi Dukes, I'm just going to yeah. have a little poke of Okay, good. Oh, we <laughs> hang on there, Flash. The boys. Nope, got to go. Right, yeah, turn around. Let me see Boss Hog. Let me see your deputy <laughs> enus. <laughs> <laughs> let, 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 let me check out Bo and Luke. <laughs> And like, and when he looks at it, he goes, <laughs> yeah, I love like, it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> bro, no. I need a new, I need a new doctor. <laughs> yeah. I might have to go out of network. <laughs> oh. Oh. Mike TV says that you can't do better than classic Evangelion. Well, uh, you know what, Mike? Since I was in both, I can tell you. Wow. So, oh, you wow. By the way, by the way How big, fast. Big, big shout out to Mike for being in the chat. We will talk a little bit more yeah, about uh, Mike, Mike uh, 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 a little bit later in the show. You're yes. kind of the star of the first act. Yep. Um, oh, my God. <sighs> But then you got to bring up the General Lee. Yeah. 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 Oh, geez. It's so much. That old rite of passage, uh. bringing up the General Lee. <laughs> and if then when the doctor I mean. gets done, he gets the review, the you know the sheet out. Well, I got them Duke boys are at it again. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> I got to tell you. You have prostate cancer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, boys are uh, again. Uh, what I'm saying. I don't want to tell you what to do with your diet, but I would suggest more. <laughs> oh. No, no, no. no. <laughs> yeah, I, I was there. <laughs> That one would have been, you should have waved everybody off for that. I so, I so. It's like, well, can I get a referral from my wife? It's like, yeah, no, I know Cooter. <laughs> no. Cooter? So oh, well, one's too up. He was a, he was a senator. <laughs> yeah, he was. was. Yeah. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Cooter was a senator. Cooter. Cooter. Say yeah. it. Try it on. Just try it on for size. See how it feels. Senator Cooter. Say it. Senator <clears throat> Cooter. Wow, Senator that's kind of hard to say. It is. Okay. But it feels... That's a song. That's a song. Yeah. Senator yeah. Cooter. Senator, Senator Cooter. I wonder... I I, 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 I I wonder hold on. Could, 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 could we play a game where we try to guess his voting record? Where it's like... <laughs> <laughs> he was a state the, senator. He wasn't a, a national senator. Whatever, dude. I'm yeah. saying there are laws, and Cooter either voted, voted for, yes, for it for or against it. Yeah. And people Where was like Tennessee? Oh, God damn it. Oh, I don't have my phone. I along with phone uh, Gopher. So, Senator Cooter <clears throat> voting along with Gopher from uh, from the Love Boat. Was he what? elected office? Yeah, he was he was a he was a senator. Or he was a, a representative. A representative, yeah. Uh, 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 like Sonny Bono. US. Yes. Yeah. Sonny Bono. But before was Sonny Bono. Before Bono. Yes. Damn. Bono. For, oh, here we go. Bono taken uh, out uh, by uh, hardwood. Uh, ben Jones was Cooter. Yep. Oh, That's shit. Right. No, he was in the U.S. House. Told you. Told you, motherfucker. Wow. But he wasn't senator. He was representative. Whatever. Representative Cooter. Representative of my heart. We love Cooter. <laughs> there. We've yeah, said it. we said it. We've said we, it. Ain't, we, ain't we ain't afraid of it. Uh, a risky statement, but I'm gonna say it. That yeah, is man. that is I one of the we weirdest moments. Uh, a friend of mine worked at. Uh, he was like a, 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 a I don't know, some uh, vice president at uh, Warner Brothers or whatever, and was taking me on the back lot or whatever. And there's that one town square. There was that one time that Josh showed up, and then there's an earthquake, and <laughs> And then Moses we turned left, the and Red suddenly sea. we were in Diagon Alley, <laughs> <laughs> and it was only forty-five dollars on the off season. Uh, no, uh, 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 he was showing me around the back lot, and he was like, "Yeah," and then they use this for a bunch of town squares, like show I don't care about, show I don't care about, show I don't care about. He's like. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, uh, Dukes of Hazard, and then suddenly it was just like, like <laughs> full on vertigo shot. Like, I was like, what? Yeah, Dukes of Hazard was kind of that was kind of a big part of my childhood. You know, it's like really, yeah. I, I just think I missed it. I think passively. I, I, I mean, was, I, I was not. I don't know if I've ever watched an entire episode of Dukes of Hazard oh, all the way through. Oh, I was part of the whole well, Southern. The I, whole Southern I, revival I, that they did, I was in that. They're I, just good old boys. Yeah, <laughs> they're, they don't no, never mean it no harm. Generally yeah. not. Yeah. yeah. Generally, no, I know. I know that theme song because there was a really good Nike ad where it was all footage of Randy Moss and uh, fuck Jason Williams, the guy who was called White Chocolate at the NBA. But they were like went to high school together and they played both like basketball and, oh, really? and football together, and so it was just like to that theme song. So I know that from that. I know yeah. the Nike ad. 
I, I don't know if this number is close to correct, but I believe I saw a Reddit post saying, like, today I learned they destroyed 281 <laughs> challengers yeah. in the production oh, of that really? show. Oh, Every the single day. time they Every jump jump, anything, they, they destroyed the car. car. Yeah. 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 That's pretty crazy. Beats all you ever saw. <laughs> They've been in trouble with the law. Yeah. Yeah. yeah since, since the day they since, was since born. They yeah. born. Yeah. Way back. Yeah. Making their way. Yeah. The, the only way, way they know how. All right. That's just, just a little, little bit more than, than the law will allow. Yeah. Let me see them jingle jangles, baby. Come on. <laughs> you have colon cancer. Yeah. There you go. Uh, <laughs> can I go ahead and get your copay card, baby? <laughs> Now let's take a look at your asshole. <laughs> <laughs> it was a meme a friend of mine put in the group chat. That's one of those uh, like like how far we've fallen like memes, and it was like airplanes in 1945, and it's like <laughs> Mad Men like fucking yeah. full suits or whatever, and it's like 2021. It's just a guy with a backwards hat that said, "Show me that asshole." <laughs> 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 There's just something about the that. Show me that asshole. That. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like uh, that sounds like something Mark Rabelle would would create. I don't know. If it just, it's either. such a per- it's such a persuasive phrase. Yeah, like you like show me that asshole. <laughs> just show me that asshole. Like, I'm like I, maybe I don't know. Like yeah. if that's real. Uh, nice. uh, uh, like number one, how did you know I had it? Yeah. <laughs> like it's a, well, no, it's like an amazing mentalist act. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It's also a big commitment on what you want your personal slogan to be. It's like, no, I, I feel confident that I'm going to meet a lot of people today. Yes. And each one of them, I'm going to want to see that asshole. I yeah. want to that, that 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 see that asshole. Yeah. He's like, uh, he's like, uh, 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 can't catch no fish, you don't cast nothing. Exactly. <laughs> like, yeah. No, it is passive advertising. To the point where, like, if you if you just walk around enough, <laughs> someone's going to show you that asshole. Because, yeah, I mean, because otherwise people get all ego, you know what this is. You know what's happening right now. <laughs> Come I'll on. Dig with a C in the chat. Show me that asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer. <laughs> I just wonder if ever he's like, no, not that asshole. No. <laughs> oh, that's not what I meant. Yeah, that's uh, that's Tricky Dick Nixon up there. No, that's not the. Mm. Uh, well, that's that the Sarlacc a- pit. <laughs> That's a good hat, though. I mean, it's, it's that's sold a good it. hat. Yeah, that's a good hat. Uh-huh. Of it's, all the hats, ranking the hats. You know, like, it's 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 got us talking. It yeah, does. I mean, that's, yeah. that's aren't we? There's no bad. It's got the conversation started. It's, exactly. It's got the conversation going right now. Uh, it's an important I, I, conversation. And I'm glad we're having. And we're, it, yes. and we're talking about it. Yeah. And we're talking about it. I'm I'm hopeful that I'm not going to derail anything, but I'll at least cast uh, much like a hat that asks <laughs> to see <laughs> that. I don't derail that. Let, <laughs> let, let me just cast this asshole. hat well, out there. Okay. Uh, 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 <laughs> is 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 there anyone here in the room who is excited about season three of what? we do in the shadows which sounds weirder when you talk about showing that asshole yeah uh, i am uh, show me that asshole <laughs> uh, <laughs> toast get out of my i want you to show me the asshole uh no when does it come back uh like like uh, t- uh two or three weeks oh shit yeah awesome. right around the corner uh so, uh, so they they shot it during the the dur- pandemic dur- dur- the demic the panini. yeah during the demic yeah uh, the uh, the, the pre- although I guess we're getting out of we're getting out of the the like meat of like everything that was that's coming out now was shot during the pandemic right there's like some stuff that that could have been shot before when, when vaccines were like like in the in. oh I see what you're like, saying yeah before when things Wait, were really right before really this scary. sorry no 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 it's still uh, scary but is, 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 really oh, no 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 hold on in that the whole thing yeah. Yeah. yeah but but in that the whole thing with like uh, i don't know i haven't seen it but the the white lotus whatever on uh, uh, hbo like like they shot that during the pandemic by going yes. to an actual island yes. and, locking and then and then yeah. and then just saying okay you've done your bit get the fuck out yeah. uh, show them daisy dukes and then off they went uh yes I think okay. for for that one yeah yeah but also HBO is weird because they only put out like, you know, like seven shows a year, right? I guess it's more now with HBO Max, but White Lotus is in their like their prestige 
Sunday spot. The Whatever Sunday that means. Spot. Yeah, you don't want to get me started on it. It's still like oh, HBO what? Max ruined everything. It's just the dumbest thing, dumbest name. It's like uh, we talk about this on Cord Killers all the time. It's like Cadillac spends 50 years designing a brand that means top of the line, high quality automobiles. Yeah, yeah. And then they announce now we have Cadillac Plus. What is it? It's a Cadillac with a free pack of Twizzlers. And it's like that's dumb as shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Twizzlers to yeah. green room. Twizzlers to green room. Yes, <laughs> yes Twizz. You've got five minutes. Cool. All right. Uh, 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 by the way, I'm. I'm. Uh, 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 man, I just want to hear that I'm right. Never mind. Yeah. No. So, uh, 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 by the way, I do think that uh, the likelihood of HBO returning to more of a discrete boutique brand is more likely now that HBO, or sorry, not, uh, uh, AT&T is not involved. All that happened because AT&T was like. Oh, we need a Netflix. Oh, fuck. Where do we go? Netflix. What's the closest thing we have to a Netflix? HBO. What if HBO was Netflix? And then they were like, I don't know what we're doing. <laughs> what ah, if, fuck. What if, what Sell if, it off. I don't give a shit. Yeah. yeah. What if I, I, thought, I thought that HBO Max was HBO and Cinemax combined. Yes. So did everybody. Really? Yeah. Yeah. It's not. It's not. It's, it's not. not. No. It's not. Hey, everyone, go there. it's not. That's I didn't go there, but I do. Anytime I watch anything on HBO, I think of it as truly a home box office. And I try to, I, you know, I go. <laughs> you I, you, I try you to pay money to, to nobody? We're not putting <laughs> you, money? You, 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 you overbuy your yeah. own milk duds. Yeah. And, then, and then you sit there and then you, you, you disturb up. yourself by chatting all yeah. around. Yeah, I, I mark up the milk duds by a lot. And then I, I make a lot of money that way. <laughs> I make way more that way from it than anything else. You're just yeah. charging your own children. I just, yeah. Like, hey, look, it's the home box office. You know, like, it's fourteen dollars. It. Look, it's not up to me. Yeah. It's not, this is inflation. I mean, right. America, me personally, but, right. I barely make any money on this. Yeah. I make money on the concessions. By the way, would you like would baloney? You like some popcorn? <laughs> would you like a peanut butter sandwich? <laughs> would, you way, like would you like water? <laughs> would you like your lunchable? <laughs> Fourteen dollars here. The have a juice I'm box. Sorry. You know, it's premium juice. Them's box. the brakes, kid. Uh, I went to a movie in the movie theater, and it was fucking awful. It was awful. It was a terrible experience. What? The only thing worse than that experience of watching a movie at the movie theater where they were understaffed, they were unprepared, they would do, clearly didn't expect people to show up to watch movies. The only thing worse is watching a movie at home, a.k.a. Hecklevision, with first-time hecklers oh, who have no good material, no. The, and they're all 17 and under. You, you, need to, you need to remember, whenever you go into this bit, that you need to remind some people who don't immediately know that you have three daughters of various ages, all of which are the worst to try and heckle, right? Because, like, you have, <laughs> I think your, your, it's... your eldest is old enough to do adult heckling bad, your middle daughter is like just beginning to understand the concept of heckling and probably enjoys it the most. And the youngest is looking at the other two and saying, I like screaming. I want to get in on this. Yeah. <laughs> do, so do, let's I, all show yeah. up. Yeah. Do you know why I'm going to write you in my will? Why? <laughs> Because you only listed three hecklers. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! I forgot the queen. I forgot the queen of the hive. This sucks. <laughs> you know what's sad <laughs> is going to a premiere for a show, and the actors are all sitting around, and we're trying not to heckle the, our own thing. Oh no! We're especially because like, you know all the bits. They it, don't know all the. Bits. Oh really? It's, it's it's animation. We don't know everything. I'm like. Oh, is that what that was about? Oh, you know? so you so you just <laughs> did your lines, and now you're watching it, and you're like, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. So, oh, so, so it, I, I would imagine that I would wow. imagine I would imagine the premiere is something like a respectful audience, everybody excited to be there, but at independent moments throughout the place, you just hear one person go. <clears throat> <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> at inappropriate weird times. With with the, the the biggest laugh, one of the we had a couple of them, but one I know we got to wrap up. But uh, what one that was really good was at the beginning of the movie it does a recap, a basic recap, and it's this movie is well, this whole series is fucked up. So the the whole thing they're going through and and made like we're just describing all of it to you and remember we're actors who came in and did our lines so we don't necessarily even after all this time we know what's going so that it it all gets and it ends and then credits right 
And we all look at each other, and there's 30 of us in the theater. I go, and now you're all caught up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, all right, uh, uh, Bryce, uh, uh, Mission Control, are you there? Twizzlers are here. We are ready for you. Thank you so much for the green room. <laughs> Thank okay. goodness. All right. Uh, we're, we're out. We love you guys. Thank you for joining us for the green room. Excited for it. Hey, uh, I just had this idea. What say we have a great night? Hey. Let's have a great night. Hey. Just some good old boys. Show me those jingle jangles, honey. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the great night pre-show. I definitely uh, was here and ready for that transition the entire time. No worries. Ah! I'm having a great day. I'm having a fabulous day and hope everyone is there too. Uh, in fact, it's so fabulous. It's so wonderful and beautiful uh, that I'm going to go to our uh, birthday borner, which is in our Discord. Discord.greatnight.tv is how you get there. I want to give some shout outs that you all have for your loved ones. Like Matt Hag Music says... Uh, his birthday's on the 20th. Oh my goodness, in three days. Happy birthday. Upcoming. Uh, Geeky Canuck. Geeky Canuck. 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 Geeky Canuck says, it is my anniversary on the 21st. Happy anniversary to Geeky Canuck. And, uh, MDTA UK, uh, their birthday is tomorrow slash today. I believe that's today. Uh, uh, over in the UK. Uh, we are going to do a little bit of a sound check here. Our friend, uh, uh, our, our, we've got a friend trying to call. Let's see, can you hear me? I can. Are you? Uh, can you hear me? I can hear you. You're coming in nice. Hey, awesome. You're coming cool. in perfectly. Uh, Beautiful. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. So, um, yeah, uh, we're we're doing good. We'll 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 give you a, we'll give you a minute here, uh, but I just want to make sure we got you connected. You can just stay on the line. We'll make sure, sure we don't. Sure. Uh, we'll mute you when. When, before you before they introduce you so you don't have to worry you can go do a thing but uh everybody stay tuned for that hey um awesome yeah um i uh, man i wanted i wanted to make small talk but i don't i <laughs> i think you i think you've been through some pretty some pretty big stuff is there any it, okay here's a question for you mike yeah do you have anything <laughs> inconsequential that's happened in the past week uh anything small yeah. <laughs> any small things no not uh, not as far as i can re not as far as i can recollect mm -hmm, yeah mm -hmm, no mm -hmm. um yeah it's all been pretty yeah it, you know yeah. the, the but, significant event uh kind of kind of erased erased everything else <laughs> that's right. it yeah. kind of overshadows yeah it kind of if you ever do you ever watch any of those videos there's a type of video that i'm obsessed with right now which are like um uh search trends like oh my goodness <laughs> we we took all of the google data from the past 15, 16 years, and here's what this, you know, select set of like singers or countries or whatever, how popular they were over uh over time. And so in yeah. my in my head, you kind of had a nice, kind of evenly distributed graph there, and then like all of that shrinks and poof, one like a big bar. Um, yeah, one significant, <laughs> yeah, one significant uh yeah, it's a mess. <laughs> yeah, and, and but I actually, actually, um, healthy addict does bring up. Yeah, we actually formed our own little scooter gang in Austin, um, of which I then uh, I then I um, I basically did the most egregious, uh, terrible thing possible <laughs> by getting. Uh, I we don't even I don't even know if I got hit by a car. I we think I do, uh, but we think I did. But I but I, I, I you know, so I'll share yeah. that. But yeah, we don't we don't know we don't really know just yet exactly what That's happened because. It's just, it's just black. Yeah. I, yeah, I, I yeah. don't remember. Yeah. yeah. All righty. Well, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll let you, we'll, we'll, we'll give you about, you get about 10, about 10, 12 minutes or so. Yeah. yeah. Uh, awesome. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll keep you on the line. That gives me plenty of time to touch myself and, you know, rub, rub oil on my nipples. And, mm -hmm. and so yeah. we'll just, we'll just mute that. We'll just mute that. Yeah. We'll give you all the space. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all righty, Mike. We'll, uh, we'll talk to you here in a uh, bit. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. All right, everybody. Hello. Welcome back to the uh to the pre-show oh my goodness i'm uh i'm having a day i'm having a little bit of a day i'm trying I'm, I'm powering through though powering through trying to trying to not over caffeinate i'm trying to get trying to get my food in order you ever need to get your food in order i feel like i've i've got to get my food in order i've i've i talked with justin all about it uh, i've talked with justin about it a, a, a few times and his advice is uh you have to 
you have to eat on a schedule. <laughs> you have to eat on a schedule uh, because that's the word. That's the thing that I'm bad about is I won't eat when it's time to eat, and I I won't eat until I feel the body signal like oh I, oh you know I'm a little I'm a little peckish. I like I get I get very you know uh, some people would call it hyper focus. I guess I don't have a uh, 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 I don't know what you call it an official whatever but you know i i i i, I kind of get tunnel vision you know i get tunnel vision and um and then i just forget to eat i just i just wake up and i go oh shit it's it's 1 a.m i have a sh i have a great night to do tonight and i need to eat <laughs> and so um that's 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 just a little uh, you know we're trying to trying to uh i don't know i'm just trying to i need to get a cadence that's what it needs is the cadence uh, by the way, we'll talk about this. On, we'll, we'll mention this on the show, but we've got a Bitly link um, if folks are looking to help Mike out. We'll talk about this. This will kind of be the first part of the show, so there will be plenty of time. We're not we're not avoiding it. We're not not talking about it. Uh, but uh, the URL bit.ly bit.ly slash help Mike TV. You can use all lowercase, um, and that'll get you there. So uh, that's that. Thank you, Nick with the C, for helping get that Bitly set up. All right, so uh, I think. We hope we got we have 10 minutes. If for some reason, that did not eat. Mm -mm. The Scooper Nova Girl says, eat when you're hungry. Time is arbitrary. But that's but the, that's, the, that's the thing. Like, time is arbitrary. But I, like, just for me, just for me, I don't, I don't, I'm not great at regulating that. And so I think, I think what I need to do, because I've got, I've got my, my things. I use the things app. I've talked about the things app on the on the After Things podcast, they've updated it in the past few years, and it's it's really nice. I think it's really nice, and you know what? For a ten uh, for a ten dollar to do app, it should be nice. It is, but I think I need to just put in there meal times. I think I just need to put I just need to put meal times in there. I think this is what I need because otherwise, then I wait until I'm hungry, and then when you're like really hungry, you want to make a big meal and make a sandwich. You need to make a sandwich. Panda says that after 45, you forget to eat and then you get dizzy. I'm 31 and I'm doing that. I'm not getting, I'm not the point, I'm not at the point of getting dizzy. That, 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 that's what I'll say. But uh, yeah, I just, I forget. I forget. Bobcat says, I used to use things, but I'm trying the Todoist app these days for the cross platformness. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, I, I you know, I don't, um, uh, <laughs> Sergeant Buffett says, God, you're old, right? No, I'm not saying that. <laughs> <laughs> not a good week not your, no 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 love, welcome back sergeant muffin also by the way it's, uh, it's 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 just not it's not good for me and it's and you know what I've, I've done that since i was a kid you know like go and play and just stay out all day and forget you know um always weird. and then and then in high school you know I, I i i i would say i would say that i had a high metabolism as a child um but i also like like in high school, and this is not an exaggeration or a hyperbole for effect. My wallet. Where's my? Oh shit! Do I? Do I? Ooh! I hope I have my wallet today. Okay. Well, mm, someone remind me to look for my wallet after the show. Um, but in in high school, me and my buddies, we we loved a DDR. We've talked about it before, and we would we would legitimately go and we would go to the mall and play it after school three or four times a week like like legitimately we would go we would post up we would we would fucking like hold court at at the at the machine and it was the nice one you could get um uh, uh you could uh, uh what is it you could put a usb drive in there and uh uh and have your custom songs and there was a whole thing about that and Oh, that was so fun. Oh, I, did, I missed that time. And, but so, so now that I've kind of like started exercising again, I'm trying and, and I'm even at the point of like, okay, well, now I don't want to overdo that, right? Because because there's some trains of thought where you're like, okay, well, if you over-exercise, if, you, if you're over-exercising, that might also be kind of an eating disorder thing. Which I, 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 I don't think that I would, I would say that I'm that far, but it's it's about trends, it's about activities. Um, uh, Heliotic says, no, you won't do that. That's hard to do. Oh, okay. Well, there we go. El Condor says, Bryce, are you a Japanese teen? Uh, I mean, in high school, in you know, when I when I got into Japanese pop and I really liked doing DDR and 
Now I'm still kind of doing that. Now I got the mat at home. I got that nice mat. I need to use that mat again. That's, that's great. But I go to the gym. I've been going to the gym. So that's, that's it. Um, yeah. Oh, by the way, uh, Ashley, we should, you, we, I've got a mat. Do you, do you, do you know that we have a mat? We, I've got a, I've got a nice, uh, uh, D, rubber D, foam DDR mat. We should, we should have a DDR day or something. Cause I got, I got the whole thing. It works on my TV. The only thing, the only like kind of wonky thing right now is just with the way it's set up. <laughs> Someone's calling me an enabler. No, it's, a, it's good. It's a great, it's great. DDR is great. Um, and so I've got like all the custom stuff. I'm running Step Mania. I've got a bunch of custom songs and DDR songs and stuff. Um, but the only one weird thing is because so much of my computer and all is set up for like work. <laughs> and so there's just enough latency between running audio and around and then HDMI's over to the big TV in the living room um, that I have to have... If you've seen me stream solo, you've seen me wear the kind of the big wireless cans. So I have to wear that. I have to wear those when I do DDR so that I have, I, that I got the, I got the, look at the low latency, the gamer, the gamer timing. <laughs> Mike, CC, Mike, Mike says, hell yeah, DDR streams. Yeah, I should, I should do, I should do one of those again. I, I, I've, I haven't done one, I don't know, maybe a month or so, but it's, it's a lot of fun. I, I also think that <laughs> when I do them, nobody wants to watch. <laughs> and so that's that's the thing that's the thing of just like well and so uh, uh but yeah uh, i, I want to do more of those it's great cardio you get to do it at home you can sweat you can sit down you can do whatever mdta uk says we know bryce is an anime and k-pop fan of course not me i'm not a big anime head i know a handful of k-pop songs i guess uh, MDTA says, but does he read Boys Love? So, I'll let, I'll let that silence kind of, I'll let that silence sit in. Um, let's see, Caitlin Phoenix said, my worst habit is I will snack to fill time. So if I'm bored, it's far too easy to grab a jar of peanut butter. Oh, uh, but, and, and there you have to like, you got to snack right. You know, you, you got a snack, right? Like uh, G. James B says, I cut my peanut butter with celery. Oh, yeah. You know, you got to you, you gotta find the right way. The, what, what I would do uh, for, for what I was doing for a minute there would be, um, oh, I don't remember the name of them. They were generic AGP brands, but they make like um, meal replacement shakes. Those are those actually tasted pretty good. And those those were because I, 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 I don't snack foods, but I do drink soda quite a bit. And that's. Then you're getting into caffeine, and then I do a pre-workout thing, which is just all caffeine. It's like caffeine and creatine or something. Um. <laughs> um, Healthy Attic says, when COVID died, di dies down, Cidercade has Step Mania X. Ooh, I would be interested to try that out. The um, the other arcade that I like to go to in town, uh, UFO Arcade, Arcade UFO, UFO Arcade, one of those two. Um, they have their they have their own like PC Step Mania setup, and that's got like all the DDR songs and a, like a lot of custom songs. But they're I mean that's that's been fucking two decades of that. Science says Soylent. I've never tried Soylent. I would be interested, Brian. Brian would you try Soylent as a snack replacement, not a meal replacement, but a snack replacement? Uh, from what I understand, it's like intentionally designed to be kind of un not unpleasant, but. <laughs> not great it's it's yeah it's food ma it's food mash it's right bachelor chow yeah but so drink bachelor chow so why would i replace like a snack with that because snacking's not great for you if you have bad snacking habits you eat a lot of yeah because you stuff. eat you eat shit you eat dog shit well, so and, stop and, eating dog <laughs> shit and start drinking soylent not specifically Brian's yeah. issue. No, 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 but, no. But no, if somebody no, no. I'm eats glad, dog I'm shit, I'm glad you brought this yeah. up. Ever since we started accepting money from Soylent, Soylent yeah. Industries, yeah. once they started paying yeah. us, mm -hmm. right. you've been doing this shit. Well, that's I've also seen you 
right. beat random dogs yeah. saying, yeah. I think you should eat Soylent. Yes. I'm being paid by the Soylent Corporation to yeah. say this. I've seen you gouge out their eyes. Yes. And I've seen you these say, true. I bet these eyes are tasty, yeah. but not as tasty yeah. as Soylent. Soylent. Yeah. And then I see you shake your shake. Yep. And then you hit the dog in the head yep. with a shake. So hard and then you're I'm like, it look times. at them yeah. bitches' titties. Yeah. And then and then you and then you just the weird part is you um, mime ejaculating the soylent all over the dog, yes. and then you lick it up off of the dog, and you hundred percent. You would look at the camera, even yes. though there was no camera there, yeah. and say, "And that's how you eat soylent." Yes. Thank you, Soylent Corporation, that was... for paying us Great Night LLC yes. for this message. <laughs> But that was because we stopped taking money from dog shit. <laughs> <laughs> Big dog hey, shit. Everybody, round of applause for that good bit. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I would, I would try. I would try soil. I keep saying that I would try. <laughs> but I don't like killing dogs. So. <laughs> Oh, do not send me a tweet. I can't see tweets right now, sign. Oh my goodness. Hello, everybody. All right. Well, it is. Oh my goodness. It's seven o'clock. Look at that. Isn't that so fun? All righty. Let's do a couple of checks here. Let's see how our talent's doing. Brian, you good? Yeah, I'm the best. Justin, you good? Yeah, I'm the best. Brett, you good? I'm all right. Uh, talking to the mic for me. One, two, three. Hey, I'm there. All right. Uh, let's see, Corey. <laughs> Feeling good. All righty. A d down with dog eyes? Yeah, that's their new story. Just the, uh, just the eyes. Just the eyes. Just the eyes. All right. Well, thank you, everybody, for joining me here in the pre-show in the green room. Uh, we'll uh, uh, we'll uh, go over to the thing. And, uh, Brett, I'll count you in to start the show. How about Alrighty. it? All righty.